Land start. Kind of came in late. Tommy going in against Rawith. Tommy getting a leap away, charge back, trying to get some heals. Tommy going in back into cheap shots, stun lock rotation. Enrage regeneration coming out, out for Tommy, but we get a vanish out of Rawath. Rawath actually is staying still close to Tommy. And I guess Tommy kind of kind of guessed that Rawath will be nearby, near their zone. Tommy's now fully DR'd on stuns, doesn't have any heals or anything. Can still do some damage to Rawath. Because Rawath doesn't have any stuns anymore. Rawath is still doing a lot of damage and takes out Tommy. I'm not the first. I'm not next. I'm not next. I'm not next. Looks like Molly though. Molly is next against against Rawath whenever he comes out. I'm just gonna mount up. While I'm mounted, I think it's okay because they can't tell. Molly versus Rawath and Rawath can mount itself for a second, I think. Is Molly? Molly's taking out way in the other area. Man, Tommy, sorry about that, man. Tournament rules, Riot. I know, I need to enable him, man. I need to enable tournament rules. I keep forgetting about it. I think they need to have it like so when you wargame somebody, it pops up and you can check tournament rules or not. And then you hit, in, you know, send invite, and then the other person gets it, and they can see if the tournament rules is checked or not. Or something like that, you know, some UI difference. Molly picks up the eyes, doesn't go for a vantage strat or anything. Should have used a vantage though. Should be able to see Rawath, but Rawath now has the opener. If he can shadow step at Molly or sap him. So this will be rough. Actually, no. Rawath gets blinded on. Trinkets and blinds Molly. Molly is now at advantage. Rawath is playing a higher health build. Opening on Molly. Molly gets a vanish off. Gets a full stun lock on Rawath. Going for another maybe cheap shot available. More cheap shots. Has shadow blades available and everything. We get a vanish out of Rawath. Molly doesn't have any dots on him. Rawath comes back into the action, into the fray. Cheap shot onto Molly. Short cheap shot. Half a kidney comes in onto Rawath. Shadow Blades is available for Molly. Both rogues are basically just uh, just just throwing at each other shadow strikes. Molly go pop an evasion. Rawath doesn't have a lot. Rawath is taken down. Molly should be able to catch a reset, but Nazira is coming at Molly. High speed. Picks up the eyes. Should be able to see Molly even if they catch a restealth. Molly is juking way out of this. Should still be able to catch the sap and a restealth. We'll see how that works out. Going in for a restyle, it looks like. No, going for an open on Nazira. Nazira is getting fully open on. Molly's at about half health. Trinket comes out of Nazira. Skyfair Totem goes down to him. Molly just decides to get away from Nazira from the totem. Earthbind Totem is going to slow him down a little. We got to charge out of Nazira onto Molly. Molly comes in with a vanish. I'm just, I'm just spectating. I'm just spectating, man. Molly's still hanging out next to Nizdira. Gets a sap on him right afterwards. Molly getting a little bit of healing. I guess he's rolling with a... Uh, oh, God for... And a cheap shot that's DR'd. Very heavily DR'd cheap shot. Wasn't enough patience on that rogue. Still going for as much damage as possible. Molly's now forced to run away. Cloak of Shadows comes out. Trying to get away. Shadow step into Nizdira. Trying to get away. But Spirit Wolves are still on him. Biting at their toes. Molly might get a vanish off early. The other grab totem comes out though. Charge out on his Dira. Gonna tear that rogue apart. Full kidney comes in. And Molly's playing defensively. Still getting rerouted or something like that. His Dira is a full stun. Molly's catching a full restealth, maybe? Caught a full restealth. What is his ability? Oh, there's the extra energy they get every time they use a whatever the fuck. Oh, they're not running more for death. That's weird. Cheap shot comes in by Molly. Onto his Dira. Short cheap shot as well. Next cheap shot is going to be even shorter. Molly just doesn't have patience. If he was a bit more patient, that cheap shot would have been full. Still getting his zero to about half health. The zero is lining up some procs available. Is that going to be enough to destroy Molly? Getting a big burst onto Molly. Vanish comes in out for Molly. Has a pretty big damage taken from Shaman's Lightning Lashes stacked up. Whoa, Shiro, Shiro, Shiro. No, 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 no. 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 Rogue isn't dead. What is going on? Hello? Rogue isn't dead. All right. Well, I guess that's how it happens. Now, Shiro versus Nazira. Let him, let him, let him have the breathing room. Let him have the breathing room. The f yeah. What, what is going on? I thought she died. No. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's have you go back and have someone go. Okay. I think they're back. Okay. Well, they're back. Nazira did get a little bit of healing back and got a bit of health back. Molly is now on the attack. That is so confusing, you guys. Come on, Europe. What's going on, man? Molly didn't die. Is Zero going and getting fully bursted by the rogue? Shadow Blades are out. I don't think there's a lot of defensive left. I feel like if Nazira and Molly continue playing and Molly didn't get those big of a reset as they did, and Shiro attacking Nazira as hard as they did with full new moon and everything, I feel like Nazira actually had that duel. So, my bad on my team for the confusion. My bad on my team for the confusion. Unless that was on purpose. Can't tell. I have no idea. 
But it looked like Molly was still alive. Molly going against Charge X. Charge X probably gonna take out Molly into Swift. Wait, oh, got Molly so low under one mil. Oh, oh, almost found him to out of stealth. Oh no, spinning to win, spinning to win. Molly's gonna reset. Charge X needs to pick up those eyes. Molly's hanging out by the eyes though. Molly knows what's happening. Is he gonna wait out? The stun's almost DR, Molly. Oh no, comes in. The shortest DR. Oh wait, no, it wasn't still shortest DR on the stuns. Shortest stuns in his life. Molly feared out right now by Charge X. Full stun lock comes in. Trinkets it. Molly's still taking a lot of damage. Blind on Charge X. Another trinket comes in. Out of Charge X. We got a, I think a reset. Not really. No, Molly's gonna get, get slapped down. What just happened? Holy shit. Okay, well. I honestly think this deer would have won that one against Molly. But Molly did get literally a full re-stealth and literally sand style the whole time, got a full health back up. Even if um even if Nazira had burst available with ascendance, I mean it's a dodge, it's cloak of shadows, it's everything available for uh for Molly at that point. So I don't know what you can do. Shiro is a boomy going against Charge X, Charge X. Bash comes in, Human Trink comes out, stuns Shiro, going for full burst, Shiro is under 1 million health, Sans comes in onto the warrior, but there's not a lot you can do, oh my god, Charge X, you're a fucking monster, Charge X is a god, man, now Yoki comes in with full burst onto Charge X, trying to get him dotted up, Charge X leaps away and dodges away, away from the survival hunter, survival hunter should play around the pillar, but Yoki is just coming at him, has a pet spider attacking Charge X, and Charge X is gonna heal off the pet. Should pull the pet back, cause now the pet is actually taking a little bit of damage. That pet is that uh, Charge X has fine fun time hanging out with the pet. He's healing full. You're literally giving him like a bag of heal. <laughs> I could have won without Boomy and attacked me and made my thing rogue die. Yeah, no, I, I actually agree with that. Charge X leaps in. The in-cap trap is actually stopping him fully. Ryoki gets full dots up on Charge X and everything. All the explosives and everything. Charge X at about half health. Ryoki is now doing the kite strat. Trinket comes in. Out of Ryoki. Out of the stone on Charge X. Charge gets in charge. Onto Ryoki. <coughs> Sorry for the cough. We got Charge X still just slowed and rooted forever and everything. With those dots. Gets a fear on both the pet and Ryoki. Trying to get away. Hoping that Ryo uh, Zioki. His name is Zioki. Sends it to the pet and he does. Gets a little bit of healing from the pet without enraged damage and everything. Oh my goodness. Battle scout maximum health increase by 8%. Just healing for a decent number. Zioki is just not letting him heal though. Trying to get him up. It's uh, the the uh, the the uh, the axis comes in. Charge X gets to charge heal with enraged regeneration using the pet to heal off of it. We get dampening at about 20%. So this way the healing is just gonna be not possible anymore by anybody. Zioki is going in for mending bandages around the back. Charge X wants to stop it as soon as possible, but he needs to pop out in the open against Zioki. Actually dropping a lot of bursts onto him. Royal sacrifice comes out. Even an aspect of the turtle. Charge X had a lot of bursts set up and just uh, stored up and has the advantage on Zioki now. Zioki popping in traps. It reflected that trap back into Zioki. Freezing trap that doesn't break. Oh my god. Charge X, my man. Oh Jesus, buddy. That is insane. That is insane how much damage you do, dude. I might just have to pop cooldowns for you, man. I might actually have to pop cooldowns for you. Because I know as, as soon as he's a... Uh, as soon as his uh, stun comes in, man, that's going to be impossible to beat. I'm going against Fear Fang, aren't I? Yep, Fear Fang. Oh, in cap. Oh, no. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh come on, another bash. Really? Really? Whatever heal I can. Oh my god, I'm so dead. I'm so dead to dots, man. I'm so dead to dots. So dead to dots. Actually dead to dots. Holy shit, Fear Fang, I can't beat that. Ferals, oh my god. Holy shit. Well, my team is a bunch of goobers. Denied Nazdira. The Shaman win against the Rogue. She had him the whole time. Oh, you guys are fucking goobers and a half, I swear. Holy shit. Well, Molly, I guess, gotta live. Charge X is insane. Oh, Feral just he literally dotted me up and just AFK. He was like dumb done. That's how that's how easy a feral is. Dot him up and done. You can just AFK. It doesn't matter what I do, I'm dead. Insane. Just unfair in my opinion. Hmm. Cause I don't I can't do anything about it. I trinket is stun. Had my uh what is it? 
<laughs> blur up. So it's like a 50-50 whether I dodge it or not. He puts bleeds up on it anyway. It doesn't matter to him. He don't care. Holy shit, man. <laughs> what? Alrighty. That works.